Hello traders, this is Jeffrey with Ninjacators again and this is the next strategy in my Ninjacator Forex strategy series. Use any one of these simple strategies that include one or more of our Ninjacator indicators for an edge when you're trading. And whether you're new to trading, you're doing this for an evaluation in a prop firm, or even if you're already an experienced traders, any of these simple Forex strategies will make you a more profitable trader. Now, today I'm going to show you the next strategy and it's going to use price action to look for the trend, show you where to spot a trend reversal and where to get in, set your stops and take profits. The strategy, like the trend continuation strategy we just did, is going to use the Ninjacator Auto Trend Line, the Ninjacator Supply and Demand Trader, and a 50 simple moving average. So let's go ahead and set up a chart and lay out the strategy. Okay, here we've got a five minute Forex pair chart. This is the Euro Dollar Live, and we're going to add the Ninjacator Auto Trend Line. Let's go ahead and bring up our indicators. So we've got the uh, Ninjacator Auto Trend Line. Just move that up. And I set it up with my colors this way. You can change that around. You can use historical lines. That's going to be very, very busy on the screen. So make sure that you've got those turned off unless you want to see lines all over the place. Um, I use a strength of five. And we'll go ahead and turn that on. And then we've got the supply and demand trader. For this strategy, we're going to use the intraday mode one to give us the maximum number of supply and demand zones. Okay, go ahead and uh, set it up with just showing the active zones, showing the historical ones can be a little bit busy as well. And then a simple 50 period moving average. So there we have it. As you can see, we've been in an uptrend and we're slowly moving down to a downtrend. Now, let's go ahead and discuss price action for a moment. Uh, let me switch this over. So as you can see, same chart. If to, in order to follow price action, we simply draw lows to highs, okay? You can use this path tool that's right here and you'll click low high higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low but then we start to fall off we've got a lower high lower low lower high not quite a lower low yet but if this candle goes ahead and breaks the bottom of this bar then we have a confirmed break in structure and a move to the downside okay and that would be exactly what this strategy is looking for and we get it, go ahead and get in right at this point but let's see what a live trade looks like in a moment so here's the strategy first we determine our bias using the 50 sma okay so in order to go short we want to see the candles below the 50 moving average just like that if we're only looking for longs price has to be above the 50 moving average. So back here, when we were in a trend continuation, we want it to be above. Then if the trend reversal, excuse me, if the crossover or the reversal is near a supplier demand zone, just like this demand zone right here, we're going to enter with one or more lots and you're going to put your stop loss behind the zone and your take profit past the next zone. And for better trade location, you can always wait to return right to the trend line or the edge of the zone to get your best location. Okay. Now, once you're in profit, you can trail your stop by the outside edge of the next zone or by following price action. Now, let's take a look at a live trade. And here we go. This is on a different day and let's go ahead and see so we've started out in the same fashion watching this trend moving up perhaps we were even in this trade and scored some uh, or, or made some money on uh, a few lots going up but as we watched price action break structure higher high higher low 
higher high, higher low, lower high. New trend line gets printed, lower low. As we move back to the trend line, we haven't really confirmed that we're going to break structure and we're still not below the 50 moving average. So we're still watching. Now we've broken structure. Once we hit this point, then I'm actively looking for a return to the trend line. We're below the 50 moving average or the edge of the zone. So let's go ahead and start it up. And we'll jump in right at the edge of that zone, best trade location. We'll put our stop loss right on the outside edge of that zone. Move our take profit to the inside edge of the next zones coming up. And make adjustments as we move along. So as we start to come down to our first take profit, we get a new zone that prints. Market slows down a little bit and we boom right through it on a big candle and we've made our first take profit. Now as we start to come down, we grab our second take profit. Now how do we trail? Well, I'm going to start to follow my price action and look for a potential break of structure and the end of this downtrend now to the upside. So I'm going to keep my eye on the highs and lows. We know we're in a downtrend. Lower, low, lower, high, lower, low, lower, high, lower, low, lower, high, lower, low. And as we keep watching, if we break structure, then we'll go ahead and get stopped out there. So we're adjusting our stop along the way. And as you can see, we had our low, still a lower high. And if we break through that lower high, now we think we're moving back up. And sure enough, the market did continue to move back up. So that is the reversal trade using price action to follow. Okay, um, We made a nice uh, almost $800 with three lots. That's all there is to it, traders. If you liked this simple Forex strategy, be sure and hit the subscribe button below. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you get all of my Forex strategies. And if you want to get these and many more indicators, then here's what I've got for you. Click on the link in the description below and join our Indicator of the Month Club. There, you're going to get a new indicator every month absolutely free. Okay, that's it. Good trading, and we'll see you in the next one.